How's it going, everyone? So as you can see, I've got this cleared off. Stuck them over here, right? Some of them. Okay, so we got a 12 volt battery. Um, we're gonna go through the configuration of this device. This is the first one I've hooked up. It's completely hooked up. Um, the first thing you're gonna do is do your number one earth ground, which is my red wire on that capacitor. Then you're gonna do your number two earth ground, which is the blue wire on that terminal there, the neons. Those two ground stakes will be separated by five meters, as I've explained. Um, the next thing you're going to do, when you get these from me, they're going to be already done. But if you're building it yourself, the very first thing you could, should do is disconnect this wire and turn on the unit. Set the voltage of this device to 30 volts or less, no more than 30 volts. And turn your amps right down to like 10 watts. Okay, and then... If everything is configured, which it is in this device, uh, I turned it on and I let it all go. And I put a, um, a light bulb on there. It's probably either blowing or it's got a bad connection because it does not light. But the volts are there, so everything's functioning. We'll turn it on for you here. And you can see from a 12 volt supply, 11 watts, we're running at 29 volts. You can hear it sparking over here, and you can see the voltage in there, 200 volts, okay, 11 watts. I can hear it sparking. I'm not touching any of it because you get the biggest lifter you've ever experienced. Okay, so I take that load off of there, and those caps are going to fly up to thousands of volts extremely fast. So this is a functioning unit. It's all ready to go and uh, functioning properly. All right, that's it. That's all. Ciao.